guys so in this video I'm going to be showing you how I got this glam makeup look it's just this olive green shimmer gold with a new lip and if you want to see how I got this makeup look just keep watching okay so I'm gonna zoom you guys up a little bit and I already did my eyebrows so but I'm going to be basing this makeup look off of this twinkle twinkle five color eyeshadow profusion palette and I think actually I'm going to take this concealer. I use this concealer right here to carve my eyebrows out. And that's what I'm going to use as kind of like a primer. I'm just going to put it all over my lid. Ooh, these are like chalky. So I'm taking this first color here. Sorry about the quality. When I zoomed in, it didn't necessarily focus. So it zoomed in, but it didn't focus. But I'm just putting this shimmery shade all over my eyelid as a base color, the first color I'm using. And I'm putting that on both oh, of my okay. eyelids. You know, I'm cover it up. <laughs> now I definitely want to use this green and this black. So, I'm going to put the black all over the lid. Let's just go for it. Put black everywhere. So now I am just taking this olive green shade in this palette. Sorry that it's blurry. But it's just this regular matte olive green shade. And I'm putting that in the crease to blend out that harsh black. Here I'm just adding on more black to intensify it since I covered it up when I put that matte green sheet. So, so in my Morphe palette, I'm going to get this color here and see how that looks. Blend those edges out. I just have to clean it up a little bit, but it's fine. You guys don't even understand how long it just took me to put this one eyelash on. Like, the band is so, like, the eyelash band is so thick. It's so hard to keep on. Now let's attempt to do this next lash. 
So the foundation I'm going to be using is the Anastasia stick foundation like always and I just draw all on my face now my damp beauty blender Oh, this part, this, all right, this I'm doing. I don't know how I feel about this. I should have just used my Maybelline Fit Me one, but I wanted to use this and see how good it is. But I don't know how I feel about this. So now I'm going to blend it out. Oh, they actually do a pretty good job covering. So you guys, I bought a new beauty blender. And then when I went to go look for the old one, I can't find it. So now I only have two beauty blenders and I have the one from Sephora and then the Real Techniques one, which I love the Real Techniques one. I feel like that's a really good one. in this palette but I don't think this is gonna good look with my skin tone I'm gonna try it so it's this but my skin tone is darker than that so I don't think that's gonna work but I'm gonna try it anyway and see how it is oh and this is Potter point this isn't bad, but, I mean, this is, like, real close to my actual skin tone, so, like, you can barely see it. It's, like, so close to my actual skin tone. It's nice if you just want to put something on for, like, light, but it's not doing much, to be honest. I'm just going to go in with my Black Radiance press powder and use that as a contour like I always do. But I'm just going to do it light. Just a light tap. And I'm just taking this Black Radiance like contour one just to really carve. And for highlighter, I'm going to use, of course, I'm going to use my, actually, let's do a drugstore one. Since this eyeshadow, this whole eyeshadow look is drugstore. The only thing that on my face is not drugstore is the foundation. And that's it. Everything else is drugstore. The eyebrows is drugstore. My, oh, and my eyelashes aren't drugstore. They're from Sephora collection but my eyeshadow stuff is from the drugstore and it looks palette it just looks like this i'm just gonna mix the first uh, well all the colors together and then see all right time for highlighting let's see if this does me justice Just 
the Gwen. Okay. Perfect. Uh, I'm going to do an eyebrow highlighter, and I'm just using this one. And then for my inner corners, I'm just going to add the same color that I have in the middle of my lid. So I'm going to go back in with this color here. Alright, let me come out. I almost forgot lipstick. So the lipstick color, I don't know. Oh, I don't know what color the lipstick to use. Should I use a stick from Mellow and Posh? That's just a little too nude for me, so I'm going to add this gloss on top. So, thank you so much for watching. This is the final look. This olive green shimmer <laughs> color. I don't know, but I really like this makeup look. And I would definitely wear this. And I'm definitely taking lots of pictures afterwards. Like. The color in the middle is definitely my favorite part. This color in the middle is definitely my favorite part. Yeah. I just love this look so much. And thank you so much for watching this video. Please make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if you liked this video. Also, leave a comment below. Also, make sure you subscribe to my channel so you know when I upload. So you don't have to wait for me to tell you. Can just, uh, notification can just come up like Jasmine Life Vlogs upload it. Yeah, make sure you subscribe. It's free. It's lit. It's a good time. You know? So yeah, thank you for watching and have a good day.